Okay, so this activity is can be a really fun group building activity and it can really talk a lot about communication skills and how communication patterns happen in a family or in a group. Um, but the first thing I want you to do before you consider doing this exercise is to think about who your participants are because we are going to ask people to use blindfolds. So you definitely want to make sure that this is something that people in your group are going to be comfortable with. So this is always an activity that you always give people the ability to opt out of doing if it's uncomfortable for them, okay? But usually a few weeks in or a few hours in, the group is feeling more comfortable and it's usually nothing that people really protest too much about. So each person has a really cheap bandana that we bought at a hobby store, okay, or a craft store. And you're just going to fold it in half to make a triangle. And then after it's in a triangle, you just roll it up. And that makes you a little um, blindfold, okay? And what's really fun is that I usually let them keep their bandanas when they're done. So that way, you know, they're not getting anyone else's germs on them, but they also mm -hmm. have a little souvenir, okay? So what I'm going to ask for each of you to do is to go ahead and take your bandana and to wrap it around your eyes and tie it in the back, okay? And because I'm going to be walking around, I'm actually not going to be wearing one. You're not. I'm not. But so I can come help you. If anybody needs help, just raise your hand and I can come help you. If at any time it becomes really uncomfortable, all you have to do is raise your hand and I'll come help you, okay? Um, okay. So what I want you to do with your blindfold on is I just want you to take your hands and place them in front of you, palms up. So hold them right at your side. Yep, at your sh hold them at shoulders, like hold them right down. I'm going to come and I might move your hands around. I'm just going to have you hold them just like that, okay? Just like that, okay? And I am actually going to place a, two pieces of rope in your hand. Actually, it's one rope, but I'm going to hand you two pieces of it, okay? So I just gave Catherine her piece. Okay, and I'm going to give Greg a piece. Melissa. When you feel it, you can wrap, you can clasp it in your hands, okay, so that you don't drop it. Okay, so you can clasp it. And last but not least, Sean's got his piece. Okay, so what you're going to do now is, as a group, and you can talk to each other, but obviously you can't see each other, what I want you to do is I want you to take this piece of rope and I want you to form a square. Form a square. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. So, you guys can talk about what needs to be so done. Step to the right, so uh, we should each be at a corner. Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. so. Kathleen should be at a corner, right? Okay, now. I'm, I'm pulling it tight and kind of to oh. the left. So I'll be the, okay. well, if you're standing where I was, the left bottom corner. Huh? We yeah, should be not too far from Kathleen doesn't feel like on the face. Yeah, on the left. I'm still not sure. That's nice. You can use your right. arms to measure. I should be able to touch you, um, right? Yeah, there, okay. Shouldn't you come up or something? I don't know. It feels it's like it's going that you? way. Come toward you? Yeah, yeah it, feels it feels like, like it's, it's angled. Angle okay. okay, so feel free to move wherever you need to do. Don't worry about the cameras. Move wherever what you think Sean, you need to what, move. What is Sean doing? I'm pretty much staying planted here. I think I've got a corner. Yeah, well, me too. Uh, that okay. would be five quarters. It doesn't <laughs> seem to be <laughs> like. <laughs> problem. It feels no. to me like whoever's ever <laughs> over here. That's, that's me. It's more of a triangle than okay. a square. Like you have to go this way. Melissa, yeah, kind of like are you so are you a corner too? I thought I was. No. <laughs> <laughs> Melissa, you're not a corner. I think not, we only need four people. Melissa, right. you need to just step forward. Okay, so I'll be person number okay. one. All right, and you're a corner, right, Kathleen? Yeah. Okay, number now one. I'm on the end of. I'm on the opposite side, on uh, Kathleen's left side. Okay, I'm so in, I in, think I'm in front of you, Greg. Okay, at least you should be in front of me. And then... Uh, so if I'm number one... Uh, Melissa, you should six. be just... I'm, you I'm should just be cool, right? right in I'm between you, yes. Kayla, and I. Okay. And, and then, then Sean should be diagonal Sean from me. Is three. Yeah. Yeah. Kayla, Sean, do you feel like you're diagonal from me? Kayla yes, I Sean do. Do you? My sense is that I am. Throw your voice a little bit. Here it is. There it is, yeah. <laughs> that me? All right. Maybe. <laughs> kind of, sort of? Yeah. Okay, are you guys done? Mm, seems like whoever's I supposed to be over here for me isn't there. I think Sean needs to move towards <laughs> To my right. To right. right. Not right. where you are. This, yeah. Whoever this person right. is. Do I is feel all right? You feel fine. <laughs> Sean, like this person I, needs Kathleen's to go not feeling here. it. I'm, I'm, I'm right not here. feeling it. Do I need to go farther? I think further that way. Throw your voice again. Let me You're right. Right here. Oh, yeah, better. no, that sounds, yeah. Like good? Yeah. Now, this is dropped or something. Yes. 
Uh, well, I a lot. Let's Kayla sounds like she's a long ways away now. Yeah. Hey, love. We should be uh, hey, hey. stretching. Yeah, Don't we should be more. stretching. Okay. All right. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I think. Are we done? I'm done. Okay. Can I go behind the curtain? <laughs> You're good. You're good. <laughs> Hey, are you guys done? Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 you tell us, are we done? No, no, you guys have to tell me. No, will you tell us? No, 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 you guys have to tell me. <laughs> Can you I support am done. I feel like right. I am done. done. Okay, so go ahead and leaving one hand on the rope, take the other hand and you can lift your blindfold up and you guys can see. Oh, very cool. Oh, wow. Not bad. Good Not bad. You guys Not are impressed, aren't bad. you? <laughs> <laughs> Not bad, yeah. Okay, so tell me what was going on in the group. Mm. Outside of great communication? Yeah, okay. okay. Some good communication, lots of feedback, <laughs> like you were really like, this does not feel like it's in the right place, <laughs> mm -hmm. right? Okay. And then and there was trust. It, it really came quite a ways around because it was definitely not a square. So he wasn't ago. where he was supposed to be, oh, right? I was like, well, over yeah. here, over yeah. here. <laughs> what were you going to say? Yeah, we, we, uh, we were, of course, we were talking a lot, but we couldn't. I, I felt that I was trying to say something, but people were not understanding the same thing that I was oh, saying. Oh, okay. Right. Like, did they really, could they really understand what you were, the point you were trying to make? Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, there's lots of ways you can use this. I mean, one, just what you said, just the super obvious is that how much of communication is nonverbal? Mm -hmm. You know, it's like being able to see the other person and get that idea. Or, even about, do we are we thinking of the same thing? You know, when we're talking, or we we have the same goal in mind. Mm -hmm. you know? um, but it is very interesting to watch the dynamics and to see who gets listened to, whose ideas get heard, how long it took kind of Catherine to get her idea heard. It was cute. I loved it. The best part was when Catherine said, "Who's to this? Who's over here?" <laughs>